Dean Walsh here, joined again once again by Heaven's Basement, uh, Chris Rivers and Sid Glover. How are you guys doing tonight? Good man, you? Good. I'm very good, thank good. you. Aaron McCannon obviously couldn't be here tonight because he's a heartbreaking son of a bitch. <laughs> so first off, guys, are you guys excited for tonight? Yeah, we can't wait. Uh, first time in Glasgow since we played Ivory Blacks in July, which was a headline show. Uh, which was banging. Yeah. It was some gig it was. I can't remember last time we didn't support in Glasgow. What, what was it, the theatre or something? No, was it? Tremonti. Oh, no, 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 that's the thing as well, I mean, you guys are so different, you're such a new band, you can pretty much tour with anyone, really. Yes, it's, it's been my sister though, it's been awesome, I mean, especially for a fan base as loyal to Black Veil Brides as their fans are to, to those guys. Yeah, they've been they've very kind of well like, Yeah, we've had a real good time every night. And I mean, you guys have been touring all over the place, you know, headline, sh headline spots, support shots all over Europe and stuff, I mean, how's, how's it been visiting all these different countries and cities? It's been a blur. Yeah, amazing. It's an amazing <laughs> blur, like multi coloured blur. Yeah, when people ask us, like, how's the tour going, what's it been like? For us now, it's kind of like the whole last 16 months is the tour as opposed to 16 in, months. individual tours, you know. Yeah. Do these guys break it all? I mean, do you just seem to be going constantly to it? Yeah, we've got a couple of weeks off coming up before we go to Sound Live in Australia. Yeah. yeah. But no, else we'll probably book some more. We'll get through. <laughs> book some more gigs. So, like, just before before this interview started, um, a few couple like last night, tweeted uh, tweeted via Gutter Magazine asking some people uh, what their questions they wanted. So I've got a few questions here. Um, this is from at Kemi one zero seven. That's you. You know who you are. This is directly to you, Sid. She says, "Why does Sid Glover ever wear a shirt? You're too beautiful for that." Because <laughs> um, it's Glasgow and it's winter. That was a good answer. Just that? Oh, yeah, I usually spend most of my time 50, at least 50% of them. So many wrong ways you can answer that question. Um, at Reckless Stacey E, with like hundreds of E's, asks, when will you be back, when will you be back in the US? Um, uh, I think we'll be back. We're going to have something to announce yeah. soon. Oh, I know, so, um, like I said, we, we saw the idea of having time off. And, like, fuck that. <laughs> Depends where Reckless Space is from, though, as well, because the US is like the size of Europe, so hopefully. And the rest. Be, yeah. Hopefully, it'll be somewhere near Stacey. <laughs> um, at Lizzie DHR asks, uh, What are good tips for songwriting and melodies? Uh, listen to as much music as possible. I think that's and, don't, and don't be judgmental and, and like biased on genre. Yeah. Because um, there's, there's some great things to be learned from different kinds of music. But really, that, that's the thing, it's like, it's great, and um, songwriting, all around, you just have to go out and listen to it. Um, at Ed Noni, Ed Noni, is that right? Uh, he asks, um, which festivals are you doing in the UK in 2014? Um, so, sure. so far, we're only confirmed for Takedown Festival in Southampton. When uh, that's announced, that's part of our UK tour, it's like in the middle of it somewhere. Yeah. Um, I'm going to do some European ones. Yeah. I'm doing Sweden work. Yeah. I'm sure I'm sure there'll be something else come up, you know, we're, we're trying to figure out how to make the most of the year one. It's, a, it's another big target for a year for us next year and obviously we're going places like Australia for the first time. Yeah. We're taking on even more and you know, there's not enough days in the year, we, so we've got to Yeah, we've booked up to our headlines or March and April. Oh, it's about time. Looking on from there. Yeah. Okay. Um, one last question from the tweet says, SabSab86 asks, um, are you guys ready to take over the world because you took over my smiley face? <laughs> That's all we need. So that sounds like someone blind, eh? <laughs> 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 yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, nothing, I mean, I have got nothing else on my plate. So yeah. Nothing left of this. <laughs> that sounds good. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we've never, there's still parts of the world we've never been to. Obviously, I mean, this is our first time around, so, but we would have done. A lot. We want to. It'd be cool to go like South America and yeah, and Asia, Asia and at some point. Australia's never been there. Yeah, sure. Give it's us really, a stage or like, give us a room to play. We'll do it. It's, it's like the I said earlier. The hardest thing at the moment now is like deciding where we should spend our time because we could go to all these places, but then we don't want to be away from England or Europe yeah. for too long, or we don't want to be away from America for too long after all the work we've done over here. So it's about like getting all these countries and 
Yeah. Yeah. Trying yeah. to keep like five plates spinning. Yeah. Yeah. And, and your home state, I mean, that's where it is. You know, that's where you get your crowds. And oh yeah, that's fine. Where, mm. where it all started. Yeah. And um, so, obviously, Fire Fire came out uh, later on this year, and just last month you you released the Fire Fire Special Edition. So, for those who haven't bought it yet, what is what makes it so special? I've I've not actually seen it. Yet, so he's not even seen his own DVD. special DVD. From that one. I mean, I was there. Yeah, I was there. Well, I, I, we had a great time. Yeah, today, it's so like, no, what is it? It's a, it's, a, it's a special edition of the whole album, the Philip Young. So, on that, there are there's some uh, videos from us like the performance of Downloads Festival. Um, there's live some tracks. live tracks from our last headline show <laughs> at the Hundred Club, which was kind of like a, a special kind of fun show. So we put that on, and a, and a few songs that aren't on the album, a couple of old school ones as well. Yeah. So, yeah, it's, good. it's a great stocking filler for Christmas. Yeah. It's right as well. If you've got big squares, so. <laughs> there you go. Christmas coming up. Yeah, Philadelphia Empire Special Edition. Um, so again, close to the end of the year. What's been some of your highlights of 2013? Um, the uh, festivals in the summer are amazing. The, yeah, the, the, I mean, the US ones in May. Then coming back and doing that. You got to do that one. That was the like, yeah, place to be. That, that was yeah. awesome. Um, we ready. Doing our yeah. first yeah. like sort of sellout UK yeah. tour, headline tour. Yeah. That was. Yeah. Yeah. That was cool because normally we used to, it's not that we hadn't sold out gigs before, but normally it would be on the day that we would sell Yeah. Whereas this was the first time that tickets had sold out ages in advance and that was like, that was, that was just a different thing for us. So that was cool. It's good feeling, like, isn't it? Yeah. Um, so when this tour is finished, he's going back home for Christmas? We have like it's four, four weeks off and then we start again. It's the longest time we've had off for about two and a half years. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So we were going to come off, but I don't know what's going to happen. It's going to be a world and feel like a fish out of water. You're going to feel weird just coming back to regular life? No. I'm, yeah, I'm making sure already. I'm already we're putting loads of things to do. From the day, the last day of this tour in Nottingham, I'm already booking up things to do just because... I think I don't, if, I, if I have nothing to do, I'll just go... I actually won't be surprised if we all suffer from uh, like the land sickness or sailors going to have to stop the travelling. No. <laughs> uh, so, have you got any band re resolutions for 2004? What's your goals coming up next year? Touring um, a lot, taking no breaks, I imagine. To do more gigs. To, do, to, to, to smash this, the, the next one. Because we're doing a Welcome Home. The, one, the tour's called Welcome Home. Um, uh, we're doing that with um, Glamour of the Kill and the Dirty Youth, they're kind of albums. We're going to be touring all around the UK and they're much bigger venues than we've ever done before, so that's going to be exciting. Yeah. And it's also our first ever headline tour in Europe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that, my resolution is to <laughs> make that. Yeah, that's going to be a big, big highlight. Yeah. Yeah. Looking forward to coming back to the Cat House, I'm sure. Uh, with uh, Cat House was one of the things we played in the early days, many yeah, times. Yeah, yeah. It was always. Walking down the street afterwards, we managed to get bars from like all of the bars down that side of the way. All from, uh, from like Union Street or Argyle Street? I can't remember what's the name. No, it's just about them. It's the one with the garage as well. Ah, yeah, yeah, Sucky Up Street. Oh, I Sucky Up Street. That's a lot of pubs. It took, it took, it took, it took uh, one of them was 30 seconds. Really? Less than that. What did you do in 30 seconds to get it? It was uh, a fight kicked out between some of our friends and this girl. <laughs> Somehow. Gave him a black eye from behind. It was the most dramatic. That was Jack. Yeah. Well, walking down the street, yeah. anyway. she, she saw it about the light once. Where she just laughed him. Black eye from behind. I didn't even get down the stairs. He was walking down like get out. Yeah. <laughs> that was good. Right, another nice week out there. That was a Anyway, yeah. uh, good luck tonight. Enjoy the show. Thank you for your time. Chris Rivers, Sick Glover, Hemsworth. Thanks a lot, guys. Cheers. Cheers. Nice one.